there are a lot of people who would have us believe that kind of technology is going to solve these problems. You know, we don't really need to get together go with other people. Actually, in, often in organisations, people say you don't really need to go to conferences or meet other people. You can just phone them, or you can do it now virtually. And I think there's some truth that you can do some of those things. Um, but last night I was in Toronto and I went to a conference, a, con a concert of uh, some music from Joni Mitchell and Leonard Cohen, and and I thought. You know, you could get the CD. Would it be the same? No. Will it ever be the same? No. Will it ever? Can you have any technology which is, which if you like, get captures what it is to be human? No. So actually, you know, the the answer is not to move away from society and say, well, really, we can strip out the bits that we want and turn them into technology. We can't. And I think that's true for, if you like, people who are developing policy and practices, but also for us as individuals. I think, I, I, I think technology is incredibly useful to the extent that it facilitates social processes, but if it's an excuse not to have those social processes, then I think by and large it's damaging.